What is up everybody and welcome back to Subnautica. My name is Wolfhart and we are back to do more stuff under the oceans. So, last time we started off, got ourselves away from the life pod, just a little ways. We are kind of on the edge between the deeper biomes. So, I wanted to have a place that was a little bit away. It's a little close to the aurora for my once but eh, we'll, we'll be okay uh we do have one of these guys outside again i think a couple uh not too long ago we did a season that uh, our base was built like right there <laughs> i realized that after the fact but i, I really don't want to move so today i want to get a little bit of the base set up i want to get uh see if we can get to the sea moth and we were going to make a sea glide today so one thing we got to do is we got to build some storage because right now this is the only storage I got and for us to do that we need titanium which I do not have a lot of so I probably should go collect a little bit of titanium it is dark out but uh, that should be fine so we're not gonna go super crazy with all the titanium stuff I've already gone super crazy with scanning everything so, everything in this region I have scanned. Uh, there's no titanium anywhere. Usually a bunch right around here. I cannot see a thing. <laughs> Hi. I'm going to steal that from you. Uh, I did get a tooth from one of them. So I have one of those, but not that we really need it right now. Ooh, an egg. Like I need it. Uh, here we go. Here's some titaniums. Titaniums? Titanium. There we go. There's one. We've got another one over here, and I think there's another one on the other side of this uh, rock. And that should be okay. Yeah, up here. Oh, didn't even grab it. Quick check. One more. No. I think we're okay. So, we don't have a whole ton. There's some over there. Uh, we don't have a whole ton, but we don't really need a whole ton either because we're just going to be building like a couple of boxes. Uh, I will be looking into getting some of the other things built into this little base. It's not going to be super, super fancy just yet, but it will once we start getting like the the bigger rooms, the moon pool, and stuff like that. So, to do that, I want to make the rebreather and go diving a little bit deeper. 12 oxygen. Uh, let's see. So, some of the things that we want to make are the fabricator, which you just need the gold and a table coral sample. I want to make the medical kit fabricator, which means I just need to make another computer chip. Uh, I think I have a silver ore for that, and we're just going to make some wall lockers. So for this, I need one gold and one table coral sample. I have a gold, and I do that was copper, not a gold. I have gold. Yeah, I do have silver. Uh... I, I, I need storage. Get a table coral sample from right here beneath us. Hi. You spit your stuff out. How rude. This is our place. You don't do that in my place. Okay. Uh, table coral sample. Let's just build that. We'll put it right here. Hey, we got stuff. And immediately we're going to start making titanium. Because <laughs> we need a bunch of titanium for this. So I want to make maybe six or seven boxes. So we're not going to go completely ham with storage. I do want to make, I think, one or two of the large storage boxes, which means we need to grab some quartz out of here. 
So we're going to start placing a couple of these over here. We're going to place one here. One here. And now we're going to place one of these guys right here. And we're going to mirror that on this side for now. We'll do that. That. And that. And there we go. We have a little bit of storage now. Uh, this space, I kind of wanted... I might leave that one there. Over here, I also want to make this guy. We're going to place him right here. And then we're also going to make a little locker right here. This is going to be for uh, some tools, foods, and stuff for the days that I have, that I prepare. Uh, so what all do I need for this? Computer chip, fiber mesh, silver ore, and titanium. So for the computer chip, I need another table coral sample. That's the copper wire. I need a gold. And I think I need one more silver. Did I need a wiring kit for it? No. I do need the fiber mesh that we have in here, though. Okay. So, copper wire. Computer chip. Build. I don't have the silver ore. Now that'll start making uh, med kits for us, which we will likely need. Is there anything I can take from here to move over there? No. Is there anything? I will try to figure out how to <laughs> how to organize, organize myself over here. Ooh, I think I know what I want to do. Something I never do. Do I have enough to make one? One glass? Yeah. We're going to put a glass wall right there in that storage. Because I never do glass walls. Never. <laughs> it's a very plain view. <laughs> I'm fine with that, though. So, I think that's about all I want to do here at the base. For now, I'm going to put titanium in here. And put that in there. You can go in there. I'm going to have to do a lot of work organizing storage in here. So you get to go in there. You can go in there. This is all just kind of like randoms. Uh, we will do one for like. The stuff that comes out of the the rocks. We'll do quartz. We will do a miscellaneous. And this is like organics or creature drops. And we're organized. Yeah, you can kind of see. I did a bunch of scanning. <laughs> so I got a lot of a, a lot of logs to go read. But we want to go, uh, we want to make the rebreather. What do I need for the rebreather? So I can dive deeper and get stuff. Wiring kit and fiber mesh. Wiring kit's going to be a little annoying. Uh, oh, we also need uh, silicone for the, the fins. Wonderful. Uh, there should be some sandstone over here to help me get some, uh, some silver. Hopefully, if I can get that wiring kit, I can uh, make the rebreather. There's nothing in there. I think I think this is the area I've already kind of cleared out of uh, stuff. Just not gonna bode well for me. 
Another egg. I don't need another egg. Take another tooth, though. Those will come in handy later. Uh, I will need two of those. What was that? Ow! <laughs> I will snag those teeth while I'm here. I did find while I was swimming around in that box right over there was the, uh, can I help you? Was the, uh, first part to the mobile vehicle bay. I'm trying to remember the name of it was. So I did scan that. I got that recipe. Like, learning that recipe started. Uh... I feel like I'm really, really there we go. I'm saying, I feel like I'm really missing these things. There's one silver. Oh, there's another piece of mobile vehicle bay. If I can stop mumbling my words, maybe we can understand what I'm talking about. But um let's go ahead and scan this and then we will go uh hunt for one more. Mobile vehicle bay fragment. There we go. Uh, there's another egg. I need one more sandstone. Just one. The game doesn't seem to want to give me it. Come on, just one. I promise I'm not that bad. Hope that sees some. Whoa! I think I found one of their nests. <laughs> That's funny. Cold. Lead. Tooth. Another tooth. Eh, he's just got a collection going. That guy has the nest. Silver! Okay. A lot of stuff going on in here. This guy. <laughs> now I know where to come for titanium. Hi. Hi. It's not that. I don't have anything to fight back against him, so I just kind of have to take it and swim away. Salt. Can never have enough salt. Okay, where's the base? This way. How did I end up all the way over here? <laughs> I didn't think I swam that far. Then again, we did swim for a while. Oh, well, let me go make the, uh, the rebreather, and I'll see you guys in just a moment. And rebreather. There we go. Okay, now we can dive deeper. Um, you're at 72%. You don't have anything in you. We need some foodstuffs, which means I need to grab you. I clicked on you. Am I gonna catch ya? Gotcha. Alright, that'll give us that. I need to grab a little bit of coral. There's a coral too. There we go. Warning. Local 
local radiation readings suggest the Aurora's drive core has reached critical state. Quantum detonation will occur within two hours. The quantum detonation? Oh, it's right there. Couldn't remember where it was. Alright, so... We've got stuff for food. We've got stuff for that. Let's make the sea glide real quick. I think we have everything we need for that. I think. Seek fluid intake. Seek fluid intake. Yeah, yeah, I know. Uh, what do we need for the sea glide? Uh, oh, I did find a trash can. I scanned that. Uh, I found the start of a beacon. So I scanned that. Sea glide, where are you? Sea glide. Battery, lubricant, copper wire, and titanium. Do I have enough copper for that? There's nothing in there. I do not have enough copper for that. Uh, okay, I guess I need to go go collect some stuff. So yeah, I'll be back in just a couple minutes. Okay, I think I have everything. Another copper wire. Oh, uh, the labels. Sea glide. The sea glide will increase your effective exploration range. For your safety, please pack supplies for long journeys and stay within five kilometers of the nearest life pod or habitat. The fabricator draws from available data to provide environment appropriate equipment using locally available materials. For your safety, this setting cannot be overridden. Whatever you say, nice lady. Alright, okay, so we've got a sea glide. I've got some inventory that I need to empty. Uh, you'll also notice I made the fins while I was in there, because, uh, yeah, I've been meaning to make those. <laughs> I've just been neglecting it. There we go. We kind of got all our stuff. I will go ahead and toss the builder tool in here, because I don't really need it. The repair tool, don't really need it. And we are off. This way. To go find a s couple of Seamoth fragments. Speaking of which, got one right here. I've also got a bunch of things that I need to come scan over here now. Now that I can, at least. Got another fragment. Quartz. I'll always take quartz. Eh, these guys. They're really just a nuisance. Uh, there we go with the... Come here. New creature discovered. This guy being infected, I think. I have not done a self-scan, so... I don't know if I'm actually infected yet. Guy diving into the ground. Bioreactor. Bioreactor might be nice to have. Uh, are you something? No. Hi! <laughs> Can I get you scanned? Without you, like, deciding you want to eat me? <laughs> oh, I think he decided he wants to eat me. Go up, get some air. So we got one Seamoth fragment already. We still need one more uh, little vehicle bay fragment as well. That one shouldn't be too difficult to find. I'm not seeing anything else immediately around here. Except a whole bunch of titanium. Actually, I should probably grab some of that. I think we're going to need it for uh, stuff. 
nuclear waste disposal. I'm not sure if that's actually going to serve any purpose. Hey, dude, you can't bury yourself there. Anything in these? No. I'll just take this titanium and go. Oh, well, that's the base. I want to go this way. Look, all those fish are infected. Remind me to avoid those fish. Can I help you, dude? Something in here? Laser cutter! We want one of those at some point. Uh. Come on. Just a couple more fragments. That is a giant salt deposit down there. Come on. How am I not finding any of them? They're, they're usually all over the place. 30 seconds. Oh, I think I see another one. A nearby cave entrance, depth 90 meters, leading to an unknown environmental biome. Good to know. I think I know which one it's referring to. Yeah, I think it's talking about that one. Yeah, don't want to go in there just yet. Looking for Seamoth right now. Hi. Hi. That's a that's a wreck. Anything good over here? That's a piece I can scan. Power reactor. Oh, we got that now. Got the, got the bio reactor before we even got the sea moth. <laughs> yeah, here's another piece of it. There should be another one around here somewhere. More bio reactor. I'll take that laser cutter fragment in there. Ow! Ooh. Guys, I'm doing a thing here. These guys are vicious. That's quartz. Not interested in quartz at the moment. I'll see you hiding. Ooh, that's a couple of tiger plants as well. Oh, that was risky. <laughs> We're already low on health. Um, yeah. We got the blueprint. Now we need the, be the vehicle bay. Then we can actually build that. Um, oh, I'm, I'm like way out. Uh, I want to be careful in here because I know I'm starting to get into areas where <laughs> leviathans can show up. I do not want a leviathan right now. Hi, biter thing. Mobile vehicle bay. What's in here? Laser cutter. And that should give us that one. I'm gonna snag scan this guy because uh, they're just kind of annoying. Can I help you? <laughs> oh, he just came to snuggle. Sorry, sir. I'm on a mission. I'm in the middle of something at the moment. I'd snuggle with you, but I'm a little busy.
Okay, so for these things, I think we're gonna need a ton of uh, copper. I think we need to make like a power cell for both of them. Let's go ahead and use that right now. Let's see. Blueprints, mobile vehicle bay. Power cell. Power cell. So I need four copper minimum for these guys. And a ton of titanium. Titanium I think I actually have. Let's go ahead and make the ingots. Those should go pretty quick. I think I need to do the other one. Yeah. There we go, we got those. We're gonna need, what, two lubricants, I think? Uh, I don't we're gonna cook you because I need food. Could also use some water. Ah, delicious. Uh, let me see. So I need two lubricant and two power cells. Do I have a thing over here? I do. I need three of these though. Because I'm going to need them for silicone as well. There we go. And now I get to hunt for copper for days. Because I need a ton of copper. Okay, not a ton. I need four. <laughs> I think I only have two. Uh, I think there's some... No, oh, here's one. <laughs> yeah, there's one. Give me that. Speed away from him. Just grab his sulfur while we're in here. I won't complain about more sulfur, we do need them. Hi. Oh, there's a couple more things. Copper. Emergency. A quantum detonation has occurred in the Aurora's drive core. The reactor will reach a supercritical state in T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3. Okay then. Yeah. The radiation suit has been added to your blueprint database. Okay, thank you. Uh, how much copper do we have? We have three. I think I have one more in here. I need a bunch of these as well. Got a bunch of them under here that I would like to remove. Pick that one up. <laughs> that gives us seven, eight. That's all of that stuff. Now we just get to craft a whole bunch of things. We need two lubricant. Two silicone. We'll craft up some batteries. Uh, do I have one copper over here? No. I gotta go find one more copper. Let's go right here. I think there should be a thing in here. I'm not here to play with you.
Oh, hi. I'll take you guys since I'm in here. I'm gonna end up lost in this cave. <laughs> you got sulfur for me? Thank you. These caves are pretty cool. Uh, I think I got all the limestone outcrops in there. And... Oh, I see you. Copper! Perfect. Just what I needed. Start crafting everything else up. Two power cells. And I can make that. I need lead and I think two glass. Wow, that takes a while. Let's see, I should have lead in here. Is it one or two lead? It's one lead. So we actually can put one of those back. And now we need three quartz to make some glass. And we have everything we need. Do that. Climb on top of it and should be able to see moth. That thing looks so cool like that. Huh? We've got a sea moth! Oh yeah. So now we just gotta get prepared, go to the Aurora, get some more stuff over there, and that, then we can start uh, doing some other stuff. Uh, let's see, what do we need for that radiation suit? <laughs> so we can go to the, the Aurora probably next time. Two lead, two fiber mesh. Fiber mesh isn't that hard. It's just a little annoying. Not, not the label. Go ahead and uh, put that stuff away, and that stuff. So fiber mesh is just two of these. And then we'll get the radiation suit, which I think we'll have to swap out the rebreather. And we're all set for next time. I will make some food and water before we go over there. And... Oh, I didn't grab the lead. <laughs> yeah, this is, this is going to work amazingly when I don't have lead. Boom. What does it take to make a med kit? Just fiber mesh. That's all you do? Is you just like craft up basically some fiber mesh? Real useful. Oh, that's it for this time guys. If you liked it, like button below. If not, let me know what you're doing in the comments. I will see you guys next time. I am off to collect some fish to prepare for food and water.